<laughs> I learned a lot about sailing and seamanship from him. Uh, I just browsed through the book. I didn't have the time to read it, but uh, a lot of things what are written there, I had the privilege of learning them first hand from him. And uh, one thing that always stands out working with him is his insistence on safety, safety, and safety. Uh, and uh, I think that's, that's the bottom line, finally, coming back safe. Uh, that doesn't mean that it's all work on the boat. It's a pleasure sailing with him. Uh, we eat really good meals. <laughs> There's a happy hour every evening. <laughs> and uh, he has a rule of declaring headlines every now and then, which he will explain. It's totally democratic. With three votes. The crew have one vote, the owner has a vote, and the skipper has a vote. And as you see on Suheli, I now dominate. <laughs> and where all three have agreed we passed a headland, we'll have a drink. I've never known there be a dispute. <laughs> so, great to be back in up there. So it really takes a bit long to get to places. <laughs> they said to me, when are you going to get to Nassab? I said, well, that's a destination. Well, what about the times? So any boats don't have ETAs. <laughs> they have destinations. So we'll look at the wind. I said, no, no. I said, no, I'll leave here, heading for the Canal de Four, but that comes up from the southwest. I'll be in Sabalo. Don't worry. <laughs>